We're here today at Fazoli's Breadstick Beach. It's the first ever beach volleyball, collegiate beach volleyball match in the Commonwealth of Kentucky's history. Eagles on three, one, two, three. Eagles, sorry. Well, it's a big deal because it, it's our little slice of history as it relates to this sport. You know, we, we want to think that we're on the leading edge of this and in, in this part of the world anyway, there are a lot of young ladies who aspire to uh, play volleyball collegiately. Maybe it uh, won't be on the court though, maybe it's through the beach. If we pull this off the right way, then it's a burgeoning sport in this part of the world and, and we want to make sure that we're, we're the people that are showing uh, a lot of others how to do it. This is a really neat environment. Um, you know, it's a great crowd, uh, the energy is, is good. And it's, it's really nice to introduce um, the community and our fans to the sport of beach volleyball. It's a surreal experience. We didn't think we would be playing this sport and we got the opportunity to improve our skills and be a part of another sport and another culture and it's just been truly special to be a part of Moorhead's first beach volleyball team and the first collegiate beach match to be played in Kentucky. We've been really blessed to be able to improve our skills for beach. Um, that's helped us for our skills in indoor. Um, it definitely wasn't something that I was expecting, but I'm very grateful for the opportunity. Uh, our players um, who've embraced it, that, that, that wasn't necessarily what they had initially thought uh, their time at, at MSU would be, and, and they've done a great job with that, and, uh, and the way the community's embraced it. Um, you know, Dan and Zoli's and, and that, that whole group, uh, it, it's, it's really a, a, a warming feeling just to see how excited everybody is about beach volleyball. Well, it's great to have the opportunity to partner with Morehead State Athletics and Morehead State University on this awesome new facility for beach volleyball. We really, really appreciate the opportunity to partner. When John and I started to talk about doing this, that was one of the things that we agreed on as being our, our bedrock of what we do, and that is always looking to our community for things that we can do to help them and uh, make it a better place to live, work, and play. That's what it's all about. It really makes Dan and I proud to have this opportunity. We're both alumni of Moorhead State University. We have an understanding of what all the university does for, for the local community and the region as well, so it's uh, just a proud moment for us to be involved on such a, a nice facility for the community. It's kind of, you know, people ask me a lot about <clears throat> what does one town, one team mean to you? And this is basically, this is the epitome of one town, one team. Not only having the nice facility here, but also having the partnership with Fazoli's, which is a community leader here within our area and within our community. But for us to kind of see this to come to fruition, it's awesome. I don't think that uh, there are very many people that, that don't think that beach volleyball is going to continue to grow and I, I think it says a lot about Moorhead State um, in the way that they've decided to you know be on the front end of this and we could either uh, choose to follow the the steps of other people or we could be a trailblazer and I, I really think that that's what we're we're trying to do right now and I, I think with this facility um, with our ability to bring in some beach only uh, players and kind of grow that aspect of our program uh, I'm just real excited about the future. It's important for us to, to, to do things very, very well. And not necessarily first, but do it well. It worked out today that we did it well and we did it first.